Greetings and welcome to the Praise Quartets. And we are happy to have with us today two young ladies that are doing a lot of work in the CSRA in all of the surrounding counties of Augusta. Uh, we have Miss Patricia Johnson and our help me with the letter, Miss Harris. Mary Harrison. Miss uh, Mary Harrison. Yes. Okay, yes. good, Miss Harrison. <laughs> So we're, we're going to talk about some things that they are doing uh, here. And let me, just to give you an idea, we learned in Atlanta when we were as a representative, we learned that there was a lot, uh, some CARES money that was sent down into the area that would uh, assist folk with uh, home, home mortgages and rentals, uh, and as well as we already doing energy assistance. So Carlton, you want to take it from there? Yeah, interesting. Uh, you probably know more about it than I do. So, so if you guys can kind of feel me in it, I, I'll learn, learn as as our audience learns. For, for the first part is something called, uh, is that L-I-H-E-A-P, Low Income Home Energy Assistance Program. What, all, what, what does all that yes. mean? What is that it's, about? It's pronounced LAHEAP. <laughs> LAHEAP, yes. okay. Yes, LAHEAP, yeah. Um, the LAHEAP program, like I said earlier, operates doing, um, it's a regular program that we operate at CSRA. And with the CARES funding, when they released the funding, it just came in and we're going to operate those during the same season of the LAHEAP. So right now, the LAHEAP season is requiring for electricity assistance. The whole goal during the LIHEAP program is during the winter months is to keep the families warm, so we assist them with their gas, and in the summer months is to keep them cool, so we assist them with the electricity, um, however they cool their home. And so the CARES funds that we receive begin on in July. And for the energy assistance program, it's gonna operate a little different. Our system has to shut down for maintenance, so therefore the energy assistance portion of our CARES funds that we receive is gonna be suspended on September the 30th. And we're gonna have our cutoff date of September the 11th of accepting new applications to allow us those two and a half weeks to get all the applications that were submitted, get them processed before the system shut down on September the 30th. It's gonna be suspended for those 30 days and then it's going to resume November 1st with our regular LAHEAP. So like you said earlier, families are familiar with LAHEAP. So they already know our schedule. We're gonna begin energy assistance in November. And so until the CARES monies are depleted, every time we operate a regular energy program, we're gonna also operate a CARES program. So the families have different choices to apply. They can apply for both programs at the same time, but they can apply for one or the other. Quick example, like when we started the CARES program in July, it was for families who had not received assistance from EOA to allow hopefully some of those families who were truly impacted by COVID to receive the assistance that normally they would, would not have to seek. And then when the program begins in November, our targeted population for our regular LAHI program is going to be our seniors 65 and older. So the difference with the CARES funding is the CARES will serve anyone. So we'll be able to hit just about all the clients that come through our doors in November until the funds are depleted. So that's it's a little tricky, but that's the difference. So it is COVID related. Uh, let's back up for a minute. What counties are you, are, do you, uh, are you serving the 13 counties of the CSRA? Or how many the counties? Energy assistance we does, the 13 counties of the CSRA. Understood. Mm -hmm. What about the rental mortgage assistance? How does that work? For anybody who's behind on their rent or again with our CARES funding been impacted by COVID-19, we can assist them uh, if they're eligible, income eligible and meet the requirements with rental assistance or mortgage assistance. Are those dates the same uh, as the uh, as the energy assistance as far as September 30th and November? Or the, no, or the, uh, no. Our, okay. our CSBG CARES funding, um, that program runs from July 2020 to June 2021. How can, how can folk that's watching us today on Fred Cortez, how can they uh, get in touch with you guys? Uh, they can go to our website at www.csraeoa.org and click on the request assistance button. And at that point, they'll get two options. They can request rental assistance and they can request LAHEAP assistance. And they'll okay. click on that button and then they'll fill out the, the request form and hit submit. 
all live heat requests go to Ms. Johnson and the rental assistance applications go to our uh, central intake center. The last little piece, you got something called employment supports, some yes. kind of partnership, uh, what is that? Uh, with the employment supports, we partnered with um, the workforce uh, agencies, CSRA workforce. Uh, we're also working on a partnership with Goodwill. So any people who are going through their program who need that, uh, employment support, mainly childcare, they can refer them to us and we'll help them with that first two weeks of childcare until they get that first check. And, and also for those who are referred, if they are in need of rental assistance, we'll also help them with that as well. So, so we, uh, with the funds that you have received to assist folk with rental and mortgage uh, assistance, uh, you started in July, so I would imagine that there's been a large a uh, request or uh, uh, influx of requests that have been definitely there. so definitely so um in the past month just this past month we've had over 300 requests for assistance wow wow yeah. well we appreciate the work you're doing and uh and we'll pass this information on and hopefully some of the folk that need it most will will, will get in touch with you mm -hmm. but thank you for all you guys are doing Yes. Thank you, Ms. Johnson and Ms. Harris. Yes. And we appreciate you all coming on to share with our audience here on Parade Quartets. This is great information for the, uh, and the, we, we do cover most of the CSRA here. Mm -hmm. So um, hopefully you, you'll have some, some calls that are interested in learning about your program. And thanks again. Sure. Thank, Thank you. you. All right.